Hello, this is Jose, and this is video tutorial for week seven. And for this week, I would like to just briefly go over on how to use the sweep tool. Um, I think it's a pretty cool tool, and there's a lot of uses that um, that you can find using the tool. Um, so for um, for this video, I just want to use this as an example, just um, how to make some stairs going up to this entrance using the sweep tool. Um, it's going to be like a pyramid shaped stairs kind of going up to the door. Um, so to get started, um, what I am going to do is go to component, go to model in place, and you can use generic model or since we're doing stairs you can select stairs as well and what I need to do first is select the path that I want this um, the profile that I'm gonna make to follow so it's gonna be we're gonna make a profile of the stairs so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go to the first floor here to the floor plan and kind of um, just select uh, or make a path for the profile. So first off I'm going to click sweep and then what I'm going to do is sketch a path and then from right here I'm just going to select the path that I want my profile to go to um, and let's say I want my path to follow the middle of this window I can select it. No, it's fine. Somewhere on there. Um, and then go about a foot and a half and kind of to the middle. I'm not being super accurate, but we'll just go there. And so that's the path that I want my profile to follow. So I'm just going to click the check mark and I do have to make sure this isn't the correct level that I want. So what I can do is go to 3D and yeah, that's the, the correct level I want, want it to be. So then once I have that, I go to the elevation where I'm going to start drawing the profile. So first I click select profile and select this and then edit profile and this is where I can start drawing um, so what I'm going to do is just going to draw a few simple stairs here uh, so I'll start here and go about a foot seven inches down And I'll just keep going until I hit grade. Um, in this case, I mean, the foundation level's there, but I'm just, for the purpose of the video, I'm just gonna, not gonna think about where I want this to go down to. Um, so once I have that, I'm gonna close it off. And it's got to be one continuous line. Now there can't be open segments or or broken lines here. Otherwise, it's not going to accept the profile, and then you're going to have to um, close it off. Um, so once I have that, I think that's that should be pretty good. I click the check mark, and then I can kind of go to I can go to first floor and see. Um, that's as far as it's going to go, the stairs. I'm going to go back to 3D and we'll probably get a better view here of what's gonna, what it's going to look like. So then I click the check mark again. And there we go. Those are some stairs using the sweep tool. Um, and then I can close that off with, I don't know, putting um, 
just the floor right there or another uh, I can put an extrusion just to cover that up um, but this is kind of like this is the process you would use to or you would go through to use the, the sweep tool I think it's pretty cool um, like I said there's a lot of a lot of things you can do with the sweep tool so um, yeah that's pretty much the video for for today and I hope it helped